Hey guys, I'm LB, and apparently all this time I haven't been testing with my brain. I, I guess I must have been testing with my gut instincts instead or something. Hey Johnson here, just a reminder that the core goal of Aperture Gas Finding Science is to find gas. So make sure you let us know if you see any. If we meet our quarterly gas finding target, I promise you we will don our bondage gear, fuel our death cars, and drive around in circles whooping it up and shooting arrows at people. Who is ready to rule the wasteland? Alright, start looking. <laughs> Looking for gas with your eyes. Lasers, deadly goo, light bridges. Uh, no turrets, thankfully. Okay, this does a lot of things. Where a laser comes from. By the way, the reason I wait for the dialogue at the beginning of each level is because I don't want it to be plain when I reload the automatic save it makes when you exit the door. Because when you exit the door here, it makes an auto save, and if the dialogue's still plain, then when you load the save, the dialogue will play again, and it's really annoying. So I've learned to wait and let the dialogue finish rather than, you know, not waiting. Is that a Portal surface? I don't know what that is. But we can find out. Oh, to my right. There we go. No, that's just observation rooms. Okay. Oh, this is fun. Let's uh, save in case we mess up. There's a way out if we do mess up. I mean, I guess we can aim at that. Yeah, there's a way out. Okay. This level is well designed. Oh! Auto aim wants me to go into the orange portal instead of the blue portal. Oops, come on. What if. Hmm. Oh, I went the wrong way. So I got a hole. How about we, we aim the orange portal this way so it's more intuitive for us? There we go. The auto aim, please. There we go. You have to not be looking. Oh wait. Oh. Oh, I messed it up. I didn't even realize I was there. Okay. This is way easier than I'm making it out to be. Just like the first game. I thought I had to build up insane momentum by repeatedly loop jumping into there. I did not see this other guy here. It's too bad that you can't build up insane momentum like that. There is an escape velocity, or not escape velocity, terminal velocity. And, uh, yeah. <laughs> oh wait, what turned on the late? Oh! button I pressed, duh. I didn't even realize pressing that- I completely forgot that I pressed the button, okay? I went up there, grabbed the cube, and didn't remember that I pressed the button. I'm tired right now. <laughs> it's stormy weather and that makes me sleepy. Why is there a portal surface here on the floor? I guess so I can steal the cube at some point? Why would I want to do that? Okay, so I need the cube over here. And that'll lock me out from going back. Dare I risk it? Yes! I did it! I made the jump. Uh... Oh, I should've placed my portal first. Eh, let's just pretend I placed my portals first. 
I have a hotkey that lets me remove my portals, because honestly, it's a feature I think should be in the game. There should be a built-in hotkey for that, but nope, I have to do it manually with the console command. What caused my lane to left? Oh, it's a light bridge! I still don't know why that makes my game lag. I still don't know. Plain carry the cube. What's over here? Oh, this is the start. Uh, oh yeah, okay, I got disoriented. <laughs> this is timed. Doesn't seem like it. Oh, we're in a 2D maze. This isn't very wide, so it shouldn't be very difficult to solve. Yeah, when you have a maze that isn't very wide, it is not that difficult to solve, usually. Oh! Solved it! <laughs> That's cool. Let's go put the ball in the ball receptacle. And... What next? Oh, that's it. Okay. What if we take the cube out? Okay. Well, I destroyed that cube. I like that. That was cool. Uh, anyway guys, uh, thanks for watching, and I will see you in another episode. Goodbye!